Number one, Joe, for jazbeescasebreaks.com. 2018 Leaf Memorabilia Vault, one box. Random hit break, number four. Our last one, ever. I think ever. Big thanks to these folks. Congrats to you guys. Already, you've already won. We just have to figure out what you're going to win. Random something. All right, so there it is. There's the case right behind me. Let's pop it open. Let's see what we get. Good luck, everybody. Case is bigger than me. We got a football. A boxing glove. Baseball bat. Jersey and the usual jerseys and and uh, and whatnot in here. All right. <laughs> First thing, Jim Bunning. Leaf Autograph Baseball, authenticated by TriStar. There you go. Nice autograph, Jim Bunning. All right. Let, let's do a couple photos. I think they're about 17 by 20. First up is Murica. It's uh, Kristen Press from the women's national team. There it is, your 2015 World Cup chance. Come on, guys. The women have already won a couple World Cups. Men have to catch up. You got the Leaf Authenticity stick uh, card on the back right here, too. All right. 
Oh, yeah, she is Brandon. From football to American football, it is. <laughs> nice. That's a great moment right there. That's Ben Rothsberger, autographed, and the tackle. That's a great shot right there. Good job, Ben. Ben Rothsberger, where the, oh, here's all the pertinent stickers here for authentication. Got the PSA DNA on the back as well. All right, so it's a really nice size too. That's Big Ben, the tackle autograph photo. All right, now the jerseys. We're gonna start off with Grant Fuhr. There's the JSA. I think the autograph goes this way. There we go. That's his Oilers colors, Brandon Singh. And that's a custom jersey. Nice. We'll leave it in the bag just to keep it nicely folded there. This is this one's really cool. This is one of uh, this is one of the artists formerly known as the Boss Man. His, one of his favorite ball players, Brooks Robinson. Nice. Some of some of you old school guys probably love this guy. Autograph right on the top of the number. Hall of Fame inscription, all the JSA stuff that you need there. Very cool. Brooks Robinson autographed Orioles custom jersey. Could hit, could field. Awesome ball player. Next jersey is, I guess, a bit of a soccer theme here. Hope Solo. Yeah, the 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 color was a little intense for our camera, but it isn't. It is Orioles orange. So there's old Hope Solo right there. And Leaf Authentics sticker. Looks like Team USA jersey as well. Very cool. Hope Solo. <laughs> yeah, Brian. Brian saying, I used to know Hope Solo. She is not a nice person. Yeah, isn't she involved in like domestic violence disputes often? Great keeper though for Team USA. So, Murica. <laughs> All right, Hope Solo autograph jersey. And... I think some of you kind of, some of you called it. This I will take out of the jersey or out of the, the pouch here. There's your PSA DNA. Brazil. It's Pele. Wow, that's a fantastic autograph. Mm -hmm. 
That is awesome. And this is a nice this is a nice shirt too. You got the Brazil logo right there and you got the official Nike tag right here too. Which is pretty nice. I don't think Nike ever sponsored a uh, Brazil shirt while Pele was alive, but or while Pele was playing soccer, that is. But it's still incredible. That's still his autograph, though. Was he ever number 58? Is this what the jerseys looked like in 1958? All right, so I'll fold that up nicely after the break. All right. Boxing glove or autograph football first? Which one? First to type it in the chat. First to three gets it. Glove or football? Got a vote for glove. Second vote for glove. Glove. All right. Glove gets three votes. Oh, everyone says glove. Not a single vote for autographed football? Any guesses on this autograph? I didn't look at the, the sticker yet. But you got all the, the Beckett documentation. Is this the right way? No, it is the right way. Earl something. It's Errol Spence Jr. Autograph boxing glove. So there's Errol Spence on the on the on an Everlast glove. Looks pretty cool. I'm not a huge boxing fan, so I'm not sure who he is. Should we look it up? He Errol Spence Jr., professional boxer, has held the IBF welterweight title since 2017. As an amateur, won three consecutive U.S. national championships and represented the U.S. at the 2012 Olympics, where he reached the quarterfinals all in the welterweight division. As of June 2018, Spence is ranked as the world's seventh best active boxer, pound for pound, by The Ring magazine. There you go. Also ranked as the world's best active welterweight by the Transnational Boxing Rating Rankings Board, and second by The Ring and Box Rec. All right, so there you have it. Autograph football. John Samuelson wanted Everlast from House of Pain on that boxing glove instead. We can only hope. Maybe if we get another one of these. All right. Where's the... There's the autograph right there. Not joking. Nice. Wilson is the autograph. Actually, it's Russell Wilson. <laughs> Russell Wilson's autograph on a Wilson football. All 
That's nice. Russell Wilson autograph football. Nice. All right, so let's tuck that away. Brian wants that from Seattle Mojo. He's trying to work that Pacific Northwest Mojo. All right, so I'll, I'll bag this up nicely after the break. Let's get a move on. All right, so that should just leave us with the baseball bat, I think. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, there you go. Brian's saying Mill Creek Sports is your spot. You know, you know those guys well. So it's the it's legit, the real deal. Real deal, Holyfield. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So the tenth one here. Well, Frank Thomas usually signs on silver ink black bats. This guy here. Natural bat. We've seen this guy before. It's Al Kaline, Mr. Tiger. It says right there. I'm going to I'm going to keep it in the packaging. If you watch a previous video, so you'll see me open it up. But there you go. Nice Al Kaline autograph baseball bat. I guess they only had Al Kalen and Frank Thomas signed for this. We had a lot of Frank Thomas last year, too. Not that I'm complaining. These full-size full, full -size bats are really nice. Al Kaline autographed baseball bat. All right. Let's randomize each list just like this. Four and a three. Lucky seven times. Good luck, everybody. One, two, three. Four, five, six, and seventh and final time. Lucky seven, David Barrows down to Jeremy. Four and a three, seven times for the hits. One, two, three, four, five, six. And seventh and final time. Good luck, everybody. After seven times, the Russell Wilson autograph football on top. The Brooks Robinson on the bottom. I should copy this list, not recopy your names. There we go. Boom. Dave Barros, Russell Wilson autograph football, autograph Wilson football. Jeremy with the Hope Solo autograph jer jersey. Big Boys 007, the Jim Bunning autograph baseball. Rex, last spot mojo, the Christian Press autograph Team USA photo. Barros, the Pele autograph Nike Brazil jersey. Boombox, Errol Spence Jr. autograph boxing glove. Brian, you got the Grant Fuhrer autograph Oilers custom jersey. Boombox with the Al K line autograph baseball bat. Michael Lang with the Big Ben, the Tackle autograph photo. And Jeremy with the Brooks Robinson autograph Orioles custom jersey. And there you have it, folks. Another nice break of Leaf Memorabilia Vault in the books. Some solid stuff. Nice job, Leaf. Thank you very much, everyone. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. If you want to chase more memorabilia like this, check out our Jaspies autograph jersey breaks on jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks, everyone. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.